Good morning, Martin and crew. Today is day fry. <laughs> okay, now, yeah, today it's uh, another good day in the bush for us, hopefully. But uh, we're going to go out for some war talks and uh, impalas and see if we can find a giraffe with a babies for her. And um, we see what the bush will deliver for us today. No kidding, there we were about to be. <laughs> <laughs> Giraffes everywhere. everywhere. Hopefully. <laughs> we are going to hunt giraffes today. With cameras. <laughs> We saw some impala on the backside, so we're going to have a quick walk. And he's going to fire like that. What do you think? Oh. Yeah. It's your big teeth. Oh, this is that looks more like a he. It's a girl. Oh, it's a girl? Yeah. Oh yeah, it doesn't have the things that it is, but they're so cool. Alright, so we're on uh, day six of our hunt in the Limpopo province. This morning, uh, this morning was kind of slow actually. The the wind's been tricky, swirling. Uh, spent the first half of the morning kind of looking for pictures, taking uh, taking photos of various antelope around the farm. Late morning, we wanted to come down by the river and uh, look for impala and warthog. This group of three pigs was the the second group that we saw today. Uh, first group had uh, two females and two piglets with it. So we watched them go by. Kim uh, shot him several times with a camera. And this uh, 
this group of three came out on our right hand side. Uh, first two females were, you know, fully mature females, but still pretty small. And then this third one came out of the back, uh, just feeding off to our right hand side. Uh, behind a little bit of tree cover, once she stepped out and presented a shot, she went down quickly and cleanly, just one shot. And uh, as you can see, has, uh, has some beautiful ivory, both top and bottom, especially for a female pig. Uh, so very pleased with, uh, with what we were able to come up with today. Uh, kids and I were waiting back at the truck and they were busy in the anthill and uh, drawing in the sand. <laughs> Um, about 10.50 we heard a shot, we heard the radio, and then we heard a whistle from Robert to get on the truck and let's go. Now we have done a proper job for that, all right. Enjoy, sweetheart. Thank you. Thank you so much. Enjoy the Thank you. Thank you very much. Robert. We are going for a specific animal right now. A unicorn. Yes. I forgot to show you that a one. Double unicorn. Double unicorn. Black. Special one. It's black. black. We're going to stalk it. And you're going to shoot it. Okay. Okay. Shoot. Okay, but you have to stay close to me. They're very sensitive. There he comes. What's they show me their ass? It's charging! To the tree, say they are so! It's an aggressive dick dick! We got a young impala male with a snare. It's a problem in Africa. So uh, we're just going to follow it and take him out of his misery. People put up snares and then uh, it's called bush meat for themselves. So they put up the snares for the f meat for the table and what they don't have enough, ah, when they have enough they start to sell it. Extra income but the problem is they put out so many snares and they don't check it every day. So then you have something like this. <laughs> I see 
Beat by deformed squish head. I call him Squish Bob. <laughs> squish Bob. Squish Bob. Squish Bob Squish. <laughs> With you and Croc. Put that lime in the cooking. They said a crocodile in the pond is almost my name. Put that lime in the cooking. Don't get the children to eat it. <laughs> they make better dust than you guys do. <laughs> run, run, run. You're not kicking up your share of dust. Now everybody <laughs> <laughs>